Brooklyn and Coleman, four points his last two, three assists two games ago, a goal last game in that win to kick off this road trip against Minnesota. This one is underway at Bridgestone Arena. Rick Paul with Greg Miller in the broadcast booth. Tell us Flames Hockey, glad to have you with us. Sharon Govich, Lindholm again, to the forehead. Did that go in? Sure looked like it. Flames are celebrating. Puck still out. They chip it on goal. Fought off by Zaros. Still battling. All sorts of chaos around the Nashville goaltender. Slides back to the corner. Wow. What chances for the Flames on the power play? Here's Anderson. Feeds it over to Zeri. Gets it back. Zeri shoots and scores. Zeri on the power play. Well, they thought they'd scored. On that scramble, didn't happen, but they put it home moments later. Connor Zary makes it 1-0 Calgary. He's been struggling a bit. There's the first look off the post, and then it stays out, and the puck stays alive as well. One, two, three, Flames win the puck battle. Now four, and then right afterwards, they keep possession. A pretty tired penalty killing group now. And Zary throws it through the traffic, like we talked about in the opening, and that's Coleman right in front of uh, UC Soros there, and there's no way the goaltender could see that puck at all. It goes through him, and Zary with the goal. Did it clip off Lindholm's skate? Well, they're the going to have a look at, angle, yeah. they're looking at this now, and I'm not sure. Been unusual for Nashville coming into the game. They've scored first 22 times this season. Third most in the league, but the Flames drop first blood here. Another chance. Coleman off Soros. Scores! Soros off his glove. Play Coleman with the goal. He scored in three straight games. And seconds later, makes it 2-0 the Calgary. And this, I think, was batted in by the defender in front of the net as well. What a start for the Calgary Flames. I mean, they came out of the gate skating. And they had just skated right down. Here's the shot. And I think maybe... <laughs> it might have been going in anyway. You're might right, have been. You're right. Let's have a look. Coleman lets it rip. Might have hit the skate on the way in. It deflects. Yeah. It goes uh, off the post and in. And it might have gone off the post and in. I'm not sure if, if Yossi got a piece of it or not. Let's have another look. Yeah, oh, he I did bat it. You're right. I think he did. Good eye, yeah. Greg. Yeah. Alex Carrier. Forsberg. Shot blocked. Hit his own man in the slot. Now the Preds apply some pressure. Just past the six-minute mark of the opening period. There's a pass in front. Big save. Lerard. Loose puck. They score. Forsberg. And it's a one-goal game. Really the one line that could put pucks in the net for the National Predators. Good work down low. The first chance, an excellent save as O'Reilly is robbed, but then the puck and the rebound will go right back on right in front of the net. And there is Forsberg, who is a tremendous player and has a great season. Throws it right in. He bounces out to center ice. Right back in by Sissons. Roman Yossi with a spin move off the boards. Pocket pick, Flames take off. Kadri with Zeri going to the goal. Kadri cuts to the middle. Kadri scores! Nazem Kadri puts Calgary back up by two with a beautiful goal to make it 3-1. to one. And then Kadri with this beautiful move the minute the defenseman leaves his feet. The book on him has played a shot. Didn't. Kadri makes a pay with his 11th goal of the season. It's a chip on goal, I think. Flames defenseman gets the puck, but he's fucked. Now Parson in behind the net. Throws a pass back to Fabro. He surveys. Feeds it over. Yossi. Dante Fabro with the shot. Tip in. Colton Sissons with the tip. And it's back to a one-goal game. And from behind the net here, he's going to try to top it back D to D, and he fans on it. And then instead of giving the puck away, it goes back to the point. A little point shot. And with that, a tip right in front of the net. And that is all from the giveaway. And Sissons spins off his check and then sneaks into the left side of the fra of your frame and battling on the puck. Look up. Almost caught it up. Gets some help. Arada gets it back with a shot. And Lenar is able to make the save and hang on after a turnover. You clean that up, you're well ahead of the game. Here's a chance for an off and rush. Lindo, Huberto, right in! One between his legs, and it was turned away by Charles. As Huberto has good position here, he's in. Yep. And there is Tanev now. Nice pass to Backlund, who breaks up with Bajapani, two on two. Backlund in. Forehand, blocked by Charles. 
Yoshi into the zone. Sizich lost the handle, taken away by Anderson. Now Sari down the right side. Gains the line to Anderson. Anderson cuts to the middle. Anderson backhand scores! Anderson on the backhand, and the Flames go on top, four to two. This is just patience. He just outweights everybody. Here's Anderson, he slows everybody down, beats one defense, beats another defense, and then casually with a beautiful backhand. Takes it off his skates, up, up. And on the far side, stick side. I mean, that's just a beautiful goal by Anderson. Compassion is, I think, the word I could come up with. Yep. See. Appropriate word is period two is underway. Great first period for the Flames up four to two. Had to take it on the backhand, lost the handle as he's forced to the board, and it's tipped away by Trent. Now a race for it. Bernard thought about chasing, retreats back to the crease, makes a save off Trent. Hannafin back to Lino, shovels it in deep for Huberto. In front for Sharon Golich with a shot, turned away by Charles, got the pat on that one. McCarran. It behind the net, Tomasino's pass, bounces to Yossi, shoots, stop, rebound, back across the crease. Anderson steals with a good play to keep it alive. Here's Linholm, makes a move, in front, Charles save, rebound, stop that too. Stop Sharon Golich and then Cadre on the rebound, the puck's played out the center ice. Finally over, Tomasino's out of the box, and Tommy take a pass, Tomasino, shot wide. Not sure if Lara got a piece of that or not. Might have the way right out of the penalty box for Philip Tomasino. Wayne's still up by two. Five minutes left in the second period. And then fires a pass up the middle of Ackland. Three flames into the zone. On the wing, Mangiapane. Backland! Stopped by Charles. Rebound! Bouncing puck. Settle down. Puck battle. McDonough able to settle it down with a pass over. Fired in front. Tip on the ball. Pass saved by Millar. Another stop on a sharp angle shot by Smith. And if he gets the loose puck, planks it off the glass. Flames get it out. Inside 10 seconds left. They have numbers on the attack. Here's a chance. Fed down low. Mangiapane puts it in front. They score! Hannafin puts it in with two tenths of a second left. Puck came right back out, but Noah Hannafin, another goal by the defense. In the last second of play in the second, Flames up 5-2. Hannafin still on the ice. He'll sneak in the back door and bang in the net as he joins the attack. And with 0.2 seconds to go, Mangiapane finds Hannafin, and that's a great goal. And how about that? Oh, yeah. Okay. And another record tonight as we stayed off the main drag in Nashville. We feel pretty good right now. <laughs> <laughs> Went out for a nice meal and listened to some modal jazz last night. Back to the line. McDonough over to Fabro. Rich shot. Got through. Loose puck. Scooped up, and away goes Kadri. Ahead to Pospisil. Oh, ran into the referee and took a spill. They put skates. Karen puts the puck in. They score! A knuckleball fools Lenar from well out, and it's 5-3. Got to just be solid all around the ice, and Lenar just tries to bat one with his blocker. And that's just a mistake. Quite simple as that. That's a straight shot. He's trying to push it to the corner, and he fans on it. So, now it becomes interesting. How does Vladar react? He hasn't played in a long time. He's got a big lead. Puts the puck to the near corner. Gilbert leans on his man. Carson and plays it back to Shan with a shot. Tipped in front. Vladar down. Able to fight it off. Puck still loose. And finally, a whistle. Puts it through. And it's muscled out, two on one. Linholm with Sharon Golich. Linholm, that shot deflected across. Huberto fights to get it back, puts it down low. You got to keep your feet moving here. Lankinen, stole it, score! Sharon Golich! Lankinen with a mistake behind the net. Linholm able to steal, and Sharon Golich puts Calgary back on top by three with 5.56 to go. Lankin in here with his back to the play. Nobody helping him communication. Lindholm with a terrific play to strip the puck from the goaltender and throw it out in front. And Sharon Govich here just gets a gift and a 4 by 6 and an absolute huge goal for the Calgary Flames who are getting back on their heels a little bit in this third period. Scored in this one. Third straight game against Nashville. He has a goal and the Flames 
have won three in a row with an impressive performance on the road. They knock off the Preds, a team they're trying to chase down with a 6-3 victory here at Bridgestone Arena.